I hope you've all had a nice week. Um, <laughs> this week has been interesting, as you will hear, but we will talk more about that in a little while. In the meantime, I am here with little baby Will. I'm going to do a change and I'm also going to show you some happy mail and some other mail that I got for him and the little babies. So this might be quite a long video, but I'll try not to be too laborious with it. <laughs> so here is little Will and he is wearing the most adorable outfit that I got from babyprem.com for him. And this is an outfit with teddies on it. It's a blue outfit and it's got the most gorgeous little teddies. And it's um, little trousers. I'm touching him again. Little trousers. <laughs> and a matching long sleeved t-shirt. And a matching hat. A knotted hat. And I really love these clothes from babyprem.com because they come in the sizes one to three pounds, three to five pounds, five to seven pounds, and then newborn. And I think they go up even larger than that. But it means that whatever size your baby, even if you have a micro preemie, the very tiniest of micro preemies, you will be able to find clothes to fit your baby and nice clothes at that, not just like Niku bodysuits, although they do have those. You will be able to find some really nice clothes to fit your baby. Am I looking? I'm not looking. I'm not looking at you. I'm just kind of looking at nothing. Sorry about that, guys. Anyway, um, I'm going to change him because... I have had Happy Mail. Now, I started to open this package before I realised what it was. So I'm going to have to sort of open it again. This is the first Happy Mail I've ever, ever had. And I'm just amazed. Here is a card, or a letter, or something, which I will open. But I can't read it, obviously. Oh my gosh, I think it's in braille. It can't be in braille, surely. No, it isn't. I just thought it was because I could feel like little embossings on it. I thought for one minute then that it was in braille, but it isn't. It's got like little embossings on it. It's a pretty little note. Look, I don't know whether you can see that. I'm probably not holding it the right way. But it's, it's pretty, and I will get my friend Ria, who is doing camera work today, to read it to me. But I want to show you what else is here. I'm just going to rest this on your tummy, Will. And try not to drop anything. Look. We have this. Which is... That's, is that the front? No, I think I had it around the right way to start with. That is a little knitted romper. And... It's armless and legless. It's got little straps. I don't have anything to go under it at this moment, so I shall have to put it on Will as is. And to match, there are knitted booties. Thank you so much. I know exactly who sent this without having to be told. This is from Suzanne. Now, I'm going to get Will's things together and change his, get his, him ready for a nappy change. I don't want you to have to look at boy parts. Some people don't like that. So when I come back in a few seconds, I'm going to um, have him out of this outfit and into a clean nappy, and then I will dress him. I'll see you in a second or two. Right, I have returned. Um, so Will has now been changed. He's been denuded of his teddies. He's been changed into a clean nappy. Look at this funky nappy. It's got like all travel bags and luggage and holiday theme on it. Um, it's a lovely nappy. I have actually ordered a really cool nappy for him. And I'm looking forward. Hello, Will. Are you waving at us? Oh, look. Um, I've ordered this really cool nappy for him. I've got 
these nappies for a lot of my babies and I'll tell you all about that when it comes and it is a cloth diaper but in the meantime I'm glad to have some really nice small diapers for him so I'm just going to get him into this little suit which is dark brown it looks black on camera but it is a dark brown I'm sorry I don't have anything to put underneath it I have looked and all the outfits I bought were outfits. Um, I haven't got any long sleeve body suits or anything, so I'm just going to have to put him on it, like put it on him like this. Um, I've just I haven't needed to unbutton the underneath, so I've just unbuttoned the top, and I'm just going to slide the strap over the shoulder and button it here. And he, because he's full vinyl body, he can wear something like this and he can show off his beautiful detailing and can I turn you over sweet boy so I can do this at the button up underneath I can oops. oh I can't do that one there there we go mummy's getting her rugs in a riff there we go there we go come back this way there's a lovely boy oh look that fits him absolutely perfectly what I really need is some kind of long sleeve t-shirt to go underneath that. Cream probably would look nice. Um, and I'll have to see what I can get from Baby Prem. Long sleeve bodysuit, that's what I need. But I wanted to put this on him today. Um, okay, boots, here they are. So, as I was saying, um, if I've cut off a point open-ended I don't <laughs> I apologize so this is a brown suit with cute little buttons and it, it looks black on camera but it is actually brown and it's very nice and he's got these little matching booties which I'm just doing up the ribbons off it has been a very tough week for all of us who know and love Suzanne I'm not um, well all right I am gonna keep harping on this because I think it's very easy for things to just get swept out of mind in the hustle and bustle of living our lives looking after our families and our babies and keeping up our channels there's always something to do and it's very easy to forget that a monstrous cruelty and injustice has been done to an innocent person and yes, I know those are strong words, but I think strong words are merited. And I don't want to let it happen. Basically, it, could, it was Suzanne last week. It could be you next week. It could be me this week. If we let this kind of thing go on, everybody on YouTube in the Reborn community is at risk. And one chance remark could bring these people down on your head. And until this stops, and until Suzanne feels able and willing and safe enough to come back to us, I will be showing you a picture of this little one. Close up of his face. In every video that I do, I won't keep on about this subject because it'll get boring. But I will be showing you a close-up of his face. At some point, it won't be right at the beginning, it won't be right at the end. But you'll see it in every video I do from now on until things get better. And that way, I will be saying that I want the bullying in our community to stop. And I'm not forgetting what happened to Suzanne and I don't want it to happen to anyone else. All right, here's little Will in his new outfit and he looks so incredibly cute. <laughs> Thank you dear Suzanne for this lovely outfit. Just look how lovely he looks. His cute little chubby legs. Oh, he's just so gorgeous and his cute little feet. Now, if you'll just wait one second, I'm going to put him down and I will show you something I've got which is going to let me help take him out places. Right, I had an awful experience on eBay uh, this week. I ordered from somewhere a reborn caricot 
and it wasn't like the fantastic one over there I have for Little Angel. Don't look at it because Rhea, because it, it's all a mess over there. <laughs> I don't want you to see that corner. Um, but it's it, it's a beautiful caricot I have for Angel. Uh, but this one was an awful mess. It was flimsy and floppy. There was no supporting um, framework in it, and it reeked. It absolutely reeked of smoke, um, and I couldn't use it. It was just a disaster. So I was in tears again. I spent this whole week crying and my gorgeous husband said, look, don't cry. Just find a nice caricot on Amazon, the one that's got good reviews and I'll get it for you. So haven't I got a wonderful husband? So I'm about to have a look to see what he got. This is a baby cocoon from Phil and Ted. Oh, it's not too big. Let's get this out of the way a minute. <laughs> Just fling anything anywhere. Can you see, Rhea? Um, let's turn it this way so you can see better. Oh, look at this. Oh, how cool. I seriously haven't seen this before. Oh, oh, look, this is perfect. Right, I'm going to need some a pillow at least for in here. I can probably nick angels for now, pro tem. But there's, there's lovely padding in here. Look how thick it is. It's absolutely fab. Oh, oh, just look. I'll make me move my hands out of the way so you can see. <laughs> that is absolutely fantastic. Now, if I had a buggy, I could actually put that in a buggy. But I don't have a buggy. What I can actually do is, oh, th there's a zip, th th it zips down the other way, two, there, oh, just look at that, oh, that's amazing, oh, just wowza, I just got to see, excuse me, I'm bending down, you can't see what I'm doing, Will, where have you gone, oh, there you are, uh, there you are, mate. Darling, whoops, you dropped him. I'm all over the place today. There he is. Let me pick it up so you can see. Can you see him, Rhea? Yeah. Can you see him? Mm -hmm. There he is. Look, Will, isn't it fab? There's loads of room in there. And that will fit Angel or Me uh, Melody or I reckon even Brooke would go in there if I wanted her to. It's long enough for any of the big ones and wide enough. It's absolutely fabulous. Oh, my goodness. Oh, thank you, darling. My husband's over there. I'm thrilled to pieces. Absolutely wonderful. So that is me for now. I will be back probably tomorrow. In the meantime, have a lovely day. And um, let's be good to one another. Bye-bye.